Welcome, 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 my little Scorpios. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Week three. All right, week three, week three, week three. Let's see, Scorpio. Scorpios. I swear, I have every neighbor cutting the grass right now. And the AC is not on in the house, nor do I feel like I need it. Okay, but I'm just saying, like, I already had to shut my other two windows because my dad's in the backyard and my neighbor is on the other side of the house cutting grass. And normally I'd like to shut the windows because of allergies and stuff, but, um, I need the air. But honestly, that's actually my dad. So he's actually going to hit this side of the house first. Okay. He literally skipped the back and went straight to the side. So I don't know if that's a message for you guys. All right, Scorps. Overall energy, week three, May 2021. Ooh, I feel it. I feel it coming. Um, that is what I wanted to do with what he or she is thinking. But you're finding that balance. Ooh Something may publicly be announced or it's a win after a battle or a win after competition or something because the five of wands comes first, right? It's the first thing it pulled me to. <sighs> She's my sunflower. Love will be too much. I forget what song that is. And there's always some flowers behind her. I haven't sang that song in a long time. So that's a message for somebody. All right. How he or she is feeling. Okay. That's good. There could have been a lesson here. How she is, he, she is feeling. But it, it's like it's moving forward. Someone wants to move forward. Not quite doing anything yet. Listen to me. Whew. All mental. It's all swords. It's like not doing something, thinking about it. Can't stop thinking about you. It's trying to figure out how to do this. Someone's trying to figure out how to pull something off right now. And you're more or less like grounded. Good. It's funny. All my water's coming in as fire. It's so funny. Um, Man, someone cannot stop thinking about you. Let's see what you don't see coming. That's a ton of swords and the page of wands. Is, I don't. I just want to see what it was though. What you don't see coming. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. Maybe you're not ready. Or maybe you think you're not ready. So somebody that was holding back is about to open up and communicate. Hmm. Uh, that, yeah. No, I I know I'm right. I I yeah, I'm not. Uh, I don't like that. I don't. I don't. I don't like that. I don't know if that's the Queen of Coin, and I love the Queen of Coin, and she is here. But I don't know if you're holding back. No, see, it's like you don't see coming. I don't like that, and I only say Queen of Coin because it's coins. Ugh. And you notice how the Ten of Swords was there too? So I, I don't know. It's like somebody, yeah, see, somebody doesn't want to accept it. I told you I don't like it. Probably something comic. All right, we'll get to that. I just wanted to make sure I was getting the right vibe. All right, possible outcome. Someone was in it to win it. Somebody was definitely in it to win it. And it could be it could be a family dynamic. But this is like not wanting to make a decision. Not wanting to see something. In it to win it. Ooh. 
current past. And I think, and it's a win it. I don't know if that's the best energy like that. So yeah, juggling thoughts, ideas, people, places, things, what's next. Looks like the past, because when the chariot comes, you were dealing with the past, but now it's like moving forward, being triumphant. So you got another card of triumph. Okay. Let's get to let's get to this. This is your current energy. This balance is is uh I think you're just being real careful and To me, I feel like you're protecting your energy. It's like give a little take, take, give, take. No, let's. Tell me about the six of pence real quick. It's that even give and take, like I was trying to spit out, but there's something about it I, I don't know, and it, this is why. It's like, it's, a, it's almost like that could be a surprise, like being kept from you, like that shitty energy, like yeah, maybe too many people in the picture, but like, that's not, could it have been somebody giving it to different people? Tell me about the Queen of Swords. I mean, yeah, obviously, but like, this is your energy, right? So there's somebody you mutually like. Friends, family, lover. Okay. Um, but you're dealing with somebody right now who's detached. But you have mutual feelings. You both want to give to each other. You both want to balance something out. And I'm telling you right now, this person's straight up air. Whether they're Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, uh, it doesn't matter. It's, they're coming in as air. Yeah, they're watching. They're trying to figure it out. Want to communicate. Tell me about the current past. That's a that's a given. It's, you weren't on solid ground. It's like one step forward, two steps back. And it's like trying to balance on a wet rock. Okay. So again, yeah, not being happy with the situation. Looking for more. Wanting more. So there could have been a toxic situation. Um codependency fear of being hurt fear of moving forward but to me this is leaving a, a toxic unhealthy situation and moving forward and being extremely triumphant again like you get that you are going to be successful triumphant in something this week so whoever this is they cannot stop thinking about you trying to figure out how to move forward so yeah you're probably not talking to them so they're really upset bent out of shape king of wands at the bottom of the deck wanting their happy back somebody's not making moves because of fear this i don't think that has anything to do with a third party right this second It's, it's like fear is holding them back. And there's nothing you can do about that on your end. This energy is missing you. feels lonely, sad without you. You were there happy. Can't stop thinking about all the good times you had. But then it's like, ugh, not doing anything out of fear. Fear of a relationship. Wanting to be single, maybe. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just it's straight up fear. Yeah, see, fear of moving forward. Again, but it's going to be triumphant. I think you already know something's going to be successful. Even though you're dealing with somebody who's detached. But extremely smart, but detached. Alright, so what you don't see coming is you do got communication. And it might be why somebody was holding back from starting something new. Yeah, see, same thing. It's... It's like something's over. Somebody was holding on for way too long. Heartache, pain. So somebody's going to start opening up. 
someone's coming at you to open up, talk. Slow, slowly, but it's, it's coming. Slow communication, trying to open the door. But that's why I was like, oh, I don't like that. But I, now I just kind of feel like you don't need to like, I feel like you don't really need to worry about it. Like I thought maybe it was somebody else. It still can be. But I think now more or less this is somebody who was holding on to something that was already dead, gone, pain. See again, yeah, coffin endings. But new beginnings, something being transformed. You do have not enough though. So again, I mentioned that up here. And then boat, receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, closures. Now you got the boat twice. So yeah, I don't I don't think it's awful. This person wants to come in to try to ground a situation. So they might come in real slow. <clears throat> like, hi, you want to grab coffee? <clears throat> See, they're not doing it yet because I'm like, <clears throat> so it's it's around the corner because they're thinking about how to do it, how to push through the fear. Nothing you could do there. they got to work through that themselves or you depending on where you're at. All right, so possible outcome. This is, what did I say? This was somebody, because the Five of Swords were there, I said this is somebody that was playing to win. So I don't know what that's about. You're either dealing with a Leo or a Libra, or somebody's in Leo Libra energy, or something with an L. It's, this is somebody who didn't want to see it and was playing to win was playing for keeps, was playing for money. Doesn't want their stability to go anywhere. So that person's out. Justice is here, something's gonna go in your favor. Yep, karmic relationship. See, I knew, I felt it, it's, it's we're progressing. Karmics are getting wiped out. New things are being aligned. And that's a good thing. Could be painful for you, but it oh, such a good thing. Such a good thing. And this sucks because this was, was somebody who was just in it to win it. And for money stability reasons. You know? But it's like lying. So somebody in a karmic situation is definitely getting their just dues. They're about to get their little package of karma delivered to them this week. And that's somebody who lied about something. Feminine energy. That came in strong with another feminine energy lying. I believe it was cancer. So this is good. The right things are being pushed out. Yeah, you do have a, or did have a nice connection with somebody. Still do, but I want to say past 10, like did, like did. Maybe you walked away from somebody. Because you knew they were still dealing with a shitty situation. This is also somebody who was holding on to something that was dead and gone, but didn't move forward because of fear. So this is like slow communication coming at you. Might just, like I said, I might just be like, hi. Thinking about you, someone really misses you. Can't stop thinking about the good times, but is afraid to move forward. But they, that's because somebody was wrapped up in a comic situation. But I don't like this. The comics energy is not good. This is somebody who didn't want to see it coming and was in it to win it for the wrong reasons. And, you know, again, all I have to say is their just dues, like their little box of karma is coming right at them. And it is what it is. Hmm. Well, this was a lot clearer than everybody else's, so I think I'm going to leave this at that. You guys can join me on Patreon. The link is below. All my new my newbies, welcome, welcome. You can get all 12 Zodiacs, the extendeds, for $2 a week. I definitely do it so it's reasonable so you guys can get this. So yeah, it's just current past. It's just like there was just too much going on. Walked away from a situation where you're seriously considering it because you're not having it. There was nothing that was grounded or solid here. But now, again, it's almost like coming into alignment, justice, balance. And the person you're thinking about cannot stop thinking about you. But they're, they're very, um, 
it almost reminds me of the King of Swords. I mean, the King, it is a King of Swords. It almost reminds me of the King of Pence, very solid, because it's a loss for somebody here. Stability. You're dealing with someone who's extremely stable when it comes to the finances or how to run a household or a business, because it's the Ten of Pence. Boy, do they miss you. This energy will push through. So, you you more of your story, without even getting to the extended, you know, is balance is coming, communication is coming. Transformation is coming, death's not even here. This is a, a massive metamorphosis. This is what I was feeling in all water. It's almost, because it's like you wouldn't have even seen that coming. That's why you had to leave. And I don't think it's one of those situations, like you had to leave a situation for somebody to like miss you or see some, like, I don't think it was like that. You know, I, I think it's just like a turn of events. And I don't even see an awakening. It's just in a, a turn of events. So, it's, want to know why? Because it's, it's some shit needs to be aligned. So, you did, you had to walk from a toxic situation like it was unhealthy for you. There's no question. You gotta love Mercury. Even if it wasn't Mercury, there's some strong planets right now. Um, well, a lot of things are going retro right now. Jupiter, Mercury, Cancer rules Mercury. Mercury rules Cancer, water. But, uh... You're finding your 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 footing, because the past is like all water, right? You're finding your footing. You seem you seem content. So if that's the case, things are obviously gonna get better. And yeah, I don't like this. Somebody that comic was definitely in it to win it for the wrong reasons, and that's just dudes coming their way. Could be caught right around the corner too with those two cards side by side. But right now, this is just telling me, like, somebody didn't want to see it. Yeah, see, there's there's no emotions, lack of emotions. Somebody wasn't there for somebody. Somebody didn't want to talk about their feelings, you know, like. But this is also, like, now, like, somebody that's in their emotions. So, over, like, a masculine. Crying over somebody. Well, the, oh, the masculine is really emotional. The bread maker. Yeah, see, this is, um, this is not crying over somebody who wish. This is, yeah, see, I don't like this. It's like smiling at this energy. It's like arrogant. And then you got the five of cups. See what I'm saying? Like this, this is somebody who's like, ugh, like really like let karma do its thing here. Try to stay out of that. And this energy is, is moving, which is good. They're in the process of making a decision. Well, you know, to me, it's like decision made. It's the fear stopping somebody right now. Or because they weren't making a decision and doing absolutely nothing. This is, again, like what goes around, comes around the universe. will make sure that this energy will choose whether they choose right or wrong. <clears throat> I'll tell you that. Yeah, see, they're, they they want their happiness, their stability. They want to invest in something that brings them completeness. It's never really completeness, but like contentment. Somebody, um, you guys might have families involved here. <clears throat> Yeah, again, it's still the same thing. Leaving this, this that, that Libra energy. Leaving this and going towards this. <clears throat> and it's not turning the back on the family like that per se. It's just that type of dynamic. 
All right, y'all. I'll see you on Patreon. I love you so much. Have a kick-ass week. Bye.